morning. This is smartwatchspecifications.com, the premier site for smartwatch specs, news, and reviews. Okay, we are back with our P500 Plus Pro smartwatch. And this time, we're going to check on its support app. Okay, so we're going to install the support app in our Android smartphone. Okay, so again, the support app for this one is available in the iOS and the Android platform okay, as you can see here we have the high watch support app okay we don't know if it's the high watch or the high watch pro okay previously we have installed the high watch pro in the android platform with our i7 pro max so this time we're going to install the high watch okay so it seems like it has a different logo here so we'll check it out on the google play store so we have here the QR code. Okay, so it's the system requirements here is the Android 5.0 and above and the iOS 9.0 and above. Okay, so let's check if it's available here also. So it seems like the image here is very, okay, very small. So let's check here in the support app. It, we do have the QR code. Okay, we have the dialer, Bluetooth music. Okay, so let's check on the settings. We have the volume here. Reset sound clock. Okay. So that's the security, security settings. I don't know. Maybe we don't have a QR code here. Let's see. Okay. Remote notifier. So it's not. Facebook games. Let's see. I think they should add a QR code here. If they did not include a QR code here. Okay, so seems like we have it here. Okay, so let's try. Let's scan this with our QR code scanner. We have a QR code scanner here. Okay, so we have to have a app download. So let's try. Okay, so here, watch. So it is a link. Go to website. I guess they will just provide a link for the Google Play Store. Okay, if it's not safe, we'll not continue downloading the support app. We'll see. We'll just we're just going to search it in the Google Play Store. Seems like it's not available. Okay, that is very disappointing. It's a new watch, but the QR code. Okay, so seems like we do have. Okay, maybe it just it loads slowly. That's why. Oh, well, let's see. Let's see. Again, let's scan a QR code. We'll do it again. Again, if you have any questions regarding this wearable. Please drop a comment below and we will try to answer your queries. Okay. So we have here the iOS download. This one on the bottom part, I think that is the a APK download. So you have to sideload the app. And we have here the link for the Google Play in a or the High Watch app. So let's use the Google Play. Okay. So again, let's take a look at the smartwatch. So we have a zinc zinc alloy body here we have a flat finish ceramic back okay 2.5d screen display slim bezel here okay so as you can see very slim bezel except on the bottom part okay going back to our support app so we have it here as you can see it has the same 
logo so it is not a high watch pro app okay i guess it's the latest version is the high watch pro and we have here okay the high watch and it's a pretty popular app as you can see here 1 million plus downloads for the high watch pro we do have let's search it here i think it's just 10,000 10,000 downloads for the high watch high watch pro it's a new app just it was released i think last year i'm not mistaken around october or august okay we already have it here okay so let's check try again so we have some issues with the internet here okay let me update it okay Okay. As you can see here, it is around August 2021, the last release on August 30, 2021. So it's a very new app compared to the HiWatch app. So there's some missing features here in the HiWatch Pro. I do hope that they will update it, but still it ha it is from the same company. Okay, let's go for the high watch with over 1 million downloads. Okay, and we have some mixed review here. Okay, so let's try and install and let's see. Just 23 MB and let's check whether we'll encounter some errors or not. Okay, so still pending. We are waiting for the download. Okay, so we have successfully downloaded the app. As you can see here so let's activate first the bluetooth as well as the gps okay so anyway it will ask for it later on so let's just activate it right away okay so hi watch so let's open the app hi okay so it is asking to sign up Okay, so you can log in if you want to save your data on the HiWatch Cloud. You can use it. Okay, you can use your Facebook or what's this? A WhatsApp account. Okay. To log in or sign up. Or you can use your email address. But this time we're just going to jump over. Let's check. Okay. So here it is asking for notifications. Enable notifications. High watch is required to send applications, notifications to your remote device. Just press, I'll select OK. So here. So let's enable the notification access for the high watch. Allow it. Okay. So going back. So here is the UI, and it's asking for the GPS just allow it we already activated it so as you can see it works it continuously okay accessing our gps you don't have to activate it manually again so we have the heart rate health data blood pressure as well as the sleep here okay for the sports let's check so it seems like it supports GPS connectivity here. Okay, connected GPS. We have run, bike, and climbing. For the equipment, we have here disconnected unknown device. So this is where you're going to add your smartwatch. You see it. It will also shows. It will also also show here the settings for your smartwatch when it is connected to the support app. And this is for the profile. Okay, here in the equipment. So. We already activated our Bluetooth as well as the GPS. So it's time to connect our T500 Plus Pro smartwatch to the HiWatch Pro app. Just connect the device here. Okay. Just let it search for the wearable. As you can see here, we have the T500 Plus smartwatch. 
if you are not sure whether it's your smartwatch or not just go here to the settings of your wearable okay usually it is available in the about section okay you can see the address here okay you see it here 24 the 6 db 6261 so that's it tap on it to connect your device let's see if we will have a successful connection so it is asking to pair with the t500 plus bluetooth pairing mode just tap on pair okay as you can see very easy step by step process and we are already connected are we connected let's see okay we have the update on the time seems like we do have an update 12 14 and we have here seems like 8, 12 14. okay let's check find device here okay so it works we are connected with the support app okay as you can see we have connected our smartwatch very easy okay very stable connection so far, we did not in encounter any issues at all with our okay, pairing of the T500 Plus Pro with the High Watch app. Okay, so let's see if, we'll, if this thing will work. Okay. I do hope that they will show automatically the display here for the smartwatch will show the heart rate also but so far it did not so let's try set measuring okay so it is working okay so it did not show here but the app detected okay directly detected the results here okay what else do we have here we have the sports function supports connected gps we have let's see activate identification permission here okay so it's still loading so let's activate it here again our support app is high watch okay so that's it now you can receive SMS, okay, call notifications, just allow it. Allow also here for the phone calls, manage phone calls and contacts. Okay, for the app notifications, we have here the Facebook, okay, messenger. Okay, so that's it. Okay, going back. We also have the settings here, so temperature settings, background settings, and the profile. Okay, so far that's it for the connection or pairing of the High Watch support app. Okay, we have the High Watch support app, a step by step process on pairing it with our T500 Plus Pro smartwatch it's it is also applicable to other smartwatches okay that is using the high watch app okay so this tutorial is in the android platform we're going to show you next time our demo for the ios platform again if you have any questions regarding the installation of the high watch app in the android platform Please drop a comment below and we will try to answer your queries. Bye.